Eric, do you find it easier to learn a new language by speaking or writing it? I think if I was to pick one, I'd probably say just listen, listening to it, trying to have conversations with people was, was probably, for me, the best way for, for me to learn it and definitely how I then was able to learn Spanish too, just through talking with people. How old were you when you realised how important and valuable it was to learn another language? When I came to Tottenham and, and over time, probably when I was 24 or 25 and I'd, and I'd been here a few years and, and I started to realise how much it's, it's affected my life every day and the way I've been able to, to have relationships with people and speak to different people and how on a, on a daily basis I've been able to, to do that and, and help other people, help my teammates when they arrive from different, different countries. So in my personal life, just, just the relationships that I've been able to create because I can speak speak with that person on a completely different level. I didn't think about that when I was your age, you know, and, 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 and how it would help me so much uh, during, during my career and on a personal level as well. What further opportunities has bilingualism opened up for you? It's difficult to explain how, how many little uh, moments change because, because of speaking another language. If I'm at a restaurant and I know the waiter's Portuguese, you know, I'll start speaking to him Portuguese and and your relationship with that person completely changes straight away because you, you share something so familiar. It, I mean, almost every day of my life, because of the language, something, something different happens that wouldn't, wouldn't have happened um, without it, you know? When learning a new language became difficult, what or who motivated you to not give up? When I was little, I, as I said, I was very shy and uh, I was very scared. And when I, when I first started playing, playing football in Portugal, um, I didn't. I, I I really did not like going because um, it was all in Portuguese and I didn't speak Portuguese and I was I was I was scared, you know. So um, so my mum would literally just pick me up and chuck me over the fence to 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 make me go and play. Um, and I'm very I'm very very grateful that she did.